Hey Internet, today is National Raspberries and Cream Day. Because like most fruit, raspberries taste pretty dang good with a little cream action going on. So let's try out a little culinary experiment and see how easy it is to come up with our own raspberry and cream recipe. Alright, this is all we need. Now let's get started with this. Alright, to start you're going to use 10 ounces of this regular old cream cheese cooking cream. Put that in your bowl. Then you're going to want to put in half a cup of your raspberries. I wanted to get fresh ones, but I could only find frozen. And then top it off with a quarter cup of regular old sugar. And go ahead and whip that baby up. And once that's all whipped up nice and creamy, you want to go ahead and spoon that into the bottom of three different glasses. Then you want to top that with about a quarter cup of your raspberries in each one of those cups. And then take like a tablespoon of sugar and go ahead and give each one a little sweetness. Because those raspberries, especially since they're frozen, they're not going to taste the best. Alright, now what you need is a cup of heavy whipping cream. Go ahead and pour that in your bowl. You're going to need another half cup of your raspberries. And since those are so tart, I decided to add in yet another quarter cup of sugar. And you're going to want to whip this up until it's holding some stiff peaks and it's nice and creamy. Alright, as you can see, that mixture did not work out too well. I should have whipped the cream up on its own beforehand. But I'm going to add in another, cr another cup of heavy whipping cream and see if I can't bring it back to life. Yep, two cups of heavy whipping cream does the trick. Now go ahead and put that on top of that raspberry layer there. Alright, then top that with another quarter cup of your raspberries and then take another tablespoon and start sprinkling it on there to fight the tartness. Now you want to go ahead and top it off all the way to the brim with some of that excess heavy whipping cream mixture and you are good to go. Two types of cream, plenty of raspberries, and only one way to find out if it tastes good. Let's begin. Fill this baby right to the brim, so I gotta be careful. Let's get some heavy whipping cream mixture with some straight up raspberries. Mmm. Nice and light and fluffy, and then you get that sugar crunch from the stuff I sprinkled on there. It's actually pretty good. Thought it might be a little too tart because frozen any kind of fruit and it kind of sucks but it's not too tart at all I mean I think that's perfect let me see if I can get down there and get some of that cream cheese up here oh I don't even know if I'm gonna there might be cream cheese in this bite oh that is good that is really good. Mm-hmm. You're going to want to try this one out. If you want to make this yourself, then just copy what I did in the video. And after your tongue is done doing a backflip, you might want to click that link down below. Unless you don't mind having a creamy belly. Now, give me that cream cheese. Dig deep, folks. Dig deep. Ooh, that's good. Uh